Hi guys, and welcome back to Kai Fish Johnny. This is another video to follow up on my last video that I did about the salting of the Koi Pond. Uh, yes, I'm wearing a hat because I realised that my hair looks absolutely bloody ridiculous in that last video, so I'm wearing a hat to cover it up for the time being. Uh, as you can see there, despite it being November the 5th, bonfire night, and yesterday they are, the fish are all live and back there. I added the salt pond, salt to the pond yesterday, 12.5 kilos as, as in the video. I was going to put another 12.5 kilos in to take it up to 0.2 because I've got a poorly fish in there. But to be honest, the fish have responded super, super, super well. They're, uh, they're, they're, they're a lot more active. In fact, watch, watch this when I go closer. Watch it not work now, but generally the fish come up the closer I get to them. So, see that? It's like the Mafia. Hi, fellas. You all right? Right, anyway, as you can see, the fish are up, they're more lively, they're feeling better. Well, it seems to be that they're feeling better. Like, oh, I mean, look at how many there are there. I've got 25 in here. You can see them there, they're all looking like they want food. This is little Otis, Otis the Shag Eye. This is Fred, the famous Fred, Karachi guy. He's absolutely amazing, as I've done on some of the videos. His personality is just mind blowing. I'm going to just stay here for a second, just in case Morrison comes past the one that is a little bit uh, ill with his cart box. Um, naturally, it doesn't appear that he is going to be round, does it? Hi, Otis. That's my shag eye. Beautiful Gimrin shag eye. And there is no signs of Morrison. I have seen Morrison knocking around with his cart box. Uh, but he's not knocking around. Anyway, so the salinity level on this pond right now is coming in at uh, 0.1 because it's 12.5 kilos to my 12,500. Uh, if I do that, to my 12,500 litres of water. Therefore, I think its salt, is at, salt level is optimal. There's only one poorly fish. If that one poorly fish gets worse, we'll do something about it. But at the minute, it just seems like the salt is having a really good effect and, how, and allowing them to settle for the winter and helping with their osmosis level regulation levels. Um, there really are some stunning fish. I'm going to flip it right around because trying to incorporate my massive gynocopod head in this image is very, very difficult. So let me take you on a journey. Whee, there we go. All right, so when we go up a bit closer now, instead of seeing me, well, in a profession you see me, there we are, Morrison, here he is. There he is, just below me, Tancho, that I'm gonna call Sancho, after Jaden Sancho. Jaden Sancho, the Tancho. But Morrison's buggered off again. Winnie, Fred, Jagger, well it's not that's Jagger, this is Kiki, Kiki and Jagger look the same, Kiki used to have a love heart on her. Let's see if we can get Morrison coming back up. Where are you Morrison, come on, there you are, there you are. See him just down the bottom there, popping his little head up. He's not much such a confident fish, he's one at front feeders, but at the minute he's shy. He's the whole reason why we've resorted to this salt well, he's one more. Here we go, here we go. Look at him there. Can you see there on his back? Just on his back and on his sides. There's just little bits. If there's anyone that can help me with this, I'd absolutely love you to death. But you can see there, look, this has been with him a while. It was going down in the summer, like they said it would. Uh, we can't pox, it goes away in the summer when the water heats up. But it's not gone away completely, and I'd love the ability to find out and cure and help him. He doesn't all in pain discomfort, other than the other day he sort of disappeared for a little while. But, yeah, anyway, let's take on a little tour of the other fish. Happy with the salt, there's a Fred, the ever-present. Look at that for a fish. Look at that for a fish. November and just parading around like that. What a personality he is, honestly. I'll have to do more videos in the summer because he's just beautiful. Some other fish here on the back. I'd like to know what this one, see this silver and orange one is. 
the scales on it is beautiful. I'd like to know what type of fish that is, so if you can comment in the comments box, that'd really be helpful. Because I do like that fish. But you can see the benefits of this window of having them there. It's like coming out to the mafia, the fish mafia. Tonight you sleep with the fishes. <laughs> right, so you can see there with the window. I should have really had it down here a little bit deeper so I can enjoy it because they sort of chill and hang around here. Like I said previously, the vortex is spinning round, the water is spinning like that. So for the fish to hold themselves there, it takes a bit of effort, but it's where I feed them from. And if I get closer, they do sort of come to me, I'll come up, especially Fred. I mean, look at him, Winston there, looks like a shark. You see him? Winston and Fred, they're the boys. Getting a little bit of a reflection there, but see him tell you what in the summer you're gonna enjoy looking at him he's a belter so that's that's what it's like every night just looking at these they get even madder though you can see there the difference in the types of like not the types of koi but the, t the personalities within the fish look at Fred just lead on off Winston goes followed by Jagger that's a normal pecking order within this fish mafia and then the rest are just sort of like a little bit not outcasty but smaller in order. Beautiful though. Just watching them glide by and come to the window to say hello. It's a sensational thing, but I really do think the salt has had a great effect on it. I'll spin you back round to my giant ocopod. Whoa! So there you go. Uh yeah, I'm going to keep the salt at 0.1. Uh, I'm probably going to look forward to a few comments and advice and guidance of people within the car community because there are some people commenting a lot on my videos and it really does help me um, feel like I'm part of the community and feel like I'm not so lonely on building and looking after the fish and trying to gain knowledge because you can read all day long but there's theories and counter theories about everything and you have to find your own way just like you do with everything but I'm really enjoying it. And I don't know everything, never will. I just really enjoy doing this. And the channel has now had one video, get this, one video has had 300, over 300 views, which is mind blowingly good. And if you can like, like and subscribe to the channel, subscribe to the channel is massive for me. Um, and that'd be amazing. So every single one of you that does like, comment, and subscribe to the channel, super, super, super appreciated. Take care, see you soon.